what's your outlook for the midterms and what do Democrats have to do to overcome all the challenges? When you look at a place like Georgia, a place like Florida, where there's very likely going to be a person of color at the top of the ticket, they have to reach Obama-level support amongst black voters. And so when we start to see that approval rating drop to 73, 72% amongst black voters, I could tell you right now, any Democrat running statewide in 2022 that has 73% of the black vote has lost. Really? Full stop. There is no path to victory. Wow. I think that we have to put Donald Trump back on the ballot. When you talk to voters, this idea that if we don't vote, it could lend to a, a shift in, in partisan power in Congress, not motivating to them at all. But we later asked, well, what if I told you that if Republicans win the House, then Donald Trump will be president in 2024? Every single hand went up. Oh, really? Interesting. Every single hand. Now that right there, we can't let that happen. Interesting. But more than that, for some of these voters, it's not going to be enough to give them someone to vote against. We got to give them something to vote for. Democrats have to not go out on the stump over the next six months and make promises about what they will do with the next two years. They have to demonstrate progress on what they have done with the last two years.